Hey everybody, my name is Katimar, welcome back for another video of Vampire. We're gonna continue the series, boys, of course. Let's just go ahead and continue with uh, Darius. We gotta talk to him again. Or find a way to into his house, at least. Uh, now that we got all the information about him. One minute, please. You again. Go away. Uh, mesmerize level 2, so see. We need mesmerize level 2. I don't know how. Uh, apparently, how you get that is by completing missions. So you gotta complete this, uh, complete story missions in order to be mesmerized levels, boys. Let's have a man to man talk. Sir, wait. Stop this nonsense. I know Nurse Crane is here. Shall we speak man to man, you and I? <laughs> All right. Speak up. Don't you see we're on the same side? We fight to help the poor, sick, and abandoned. I'm nothing like you, Mr. Doctor. Yes, you are. You too believe in providing medical care without charge. You know what we have to sacrifice to make the world a better place. I have to admit your words have conviction. All right, I'll let you see Dorothea. Don't make me regret this, though. All right, that's what I'm talking about, boys. Now that's what I'm talking about. Can I? So there was the option of mesmerize too during the, like during our conversation. Does this mean that mesmerize too? We're gonna be able to use that as an object towards our uh, conversations. That would be really cool. So there he is, level two. I cannot like. It's locked, all right. I can't like. Um, uh, mesmerize him just yet because I'm only level one, but we'll see eventually got a lot of shillings Let's um, let's talk to him. Let's actually um, Get rid of his uh, a problem of branch that I you want to I've got uh, uh, the medicine go for him across the courtyard and take the stairs We've not been formally introduced May I ask your name and occupation sir? I am Darius Petrescu I'm here to keep snitches and spies away from Dorothea. And I also run this little print shop. Okay. I'm going to, do just going to do a med medical checkup because I'm I want to... Tired, but that is all. I want I to heal them up. Doctor. Uh, give me well, give medicine. There we go. Take this and you'll feel better. Free drugs from an English doctor. <laughs> It must be my lucky day. All right, personal questions. All right, so I'm going to do all of these right now, boys. Uh, just give me a second. I'm going to skip that for you. you it's not going to be important for you. It's just for me when I mesmerize him, it's going to be more XP. So give me a minute. All right, boys. So I went ahead and uh, healed him up, talked to him a little bit. He's got 2,000 XP uh, now. So when I kill him, which I believe is going to be soon, I think... I'm supposed to get uh, the mesmerized level 2 after talking to Dorothy, apparently. I, ch I looked it up, boys, I'm not gonna lie, I looked it up because I really was wondering how to level up that mesmerized. I mean, seems like uh, it's really tough to level him up. And it's really important if I want to kill more people, you know. So is there anything here I can take? Doesn't look like it. What about... Uh, okay, so... Just gotta find her, I guess. There's gotta be some. Oh, there we go. That's what I was trying to say. There's gotta be some resources I can pick. Okay. So where is she? She's probably on top right here. There we go. All right. So, she if she's on top right here. Oh, hang on. There's more resources. Let's just go, boys. Take the resources, take everything. Oh, letter to Nurse Crane. So what is this? You guys can read that in your free time. There we go. I've got another hint from her. Basically, I've got a lot of hints. Oh, shit. What the hell's going on here? Yeah. A lot of resources. It's a good place. There we go. I need help. Okay, so this shit. Hang on, I'm just gonna look around really quick. He's okay, no. Into convulsions, doctor. What do we have here, nurse? Patient Raz Van Vassily. High fever running on three days. Complaints of dizziness, muscle aches, and head pain. Diagnosed with influenza. Treatment? 
Aspirin and salicin for the fever and discomfort. Liquids for dehydration. But he's having trouble keeping even water down. Anything else I should know? Thank you, nurse. Anything else I should know? He did lose consciousness this morning, but he's never had convulsions like these. He's not convulsing. He's choking. He's not getting any air. Skull, hand me that skull. What can I do, doctor? Uh, I must prefer a tri uh, tracher stummy. Do we have anesthetic? It's too dangerous to operate with these convulsions. Sedative, nurse. Do we have any anesthetics? I'm sorry, doctor. None at all. Well, it's gonna hurt him a lot. I need to perform a tracheostomy. Short pipe. That rubber tube will do. We're going to cut a passage for air through the neck. Yes, doctor. God damn. Doing he's that right again, now. But he's coughing up blood. Internal hemorrhaging. I need to make another incision into the chest cavity to drain the fluids from the lung. Prepare another tube. A thoracostomy. Doctor, we've nothing to fight the infection. We need an aseptic environment. What would you say? Don't question me. Okay. What would you suggest? Like that, Nurse Crane. What do you suggest we do? I've no idea. I'm not the doctor. Time is of the essence. We need to perform a thoracic drain. Yes, doctor. If you don't have any idea, then don't question it, man. You want to save this man or not? He's still bleeding, doctor. I'm losing his pulse. The drain must have punctured the intercostal artery. There's too much blood. Are you all right, doctor? I... I can't see. The blood is too much for me. As a vampire, it... It's too much for me. I must suture the artery. Let me fin... No, I must suffer. I must... First, suture the artery. Find the wound. The source of the blood. Needle and thread, doctor. It's too much blood for me. I can't do this anymore. I'm a vampire. See? How's he doing? Way too much for him. We've lost his pulse. He's dying, doctor. Cardiac massage now. Epiphrine. Epiphrine. Epinephrine. A dose of epinephrine now. Yes, doctor. It's gonna wake him up. Think he's good now? Is he good or not? We lost him? We've lost the pulse. Oh, all right. He, he's gone, Doctor. Nurse, we did everything we could. Truly? Everything you could. Is that how you'll report this in your log? Is this how the war went? Piling up one poor corpse beside the next? This was not an influenza-induced seizure. I've never seen symptoms like these on the continent. Neither have I. But the previous symptoms leading up to this attack were the same, indistinguishable from the epidemic. No. There was something more vile in these reactions. Something... primitive. There have been numerous reports of mental breakdowns caused by the fever that accompanies the flu itself, Doctor. Yes, but... I'd best take some samples of the blood for analysis. Alright. Well, we didn't save him, but I didn't want to do the cardiac arrest. I thought epinephrine would be enough. Isn't what they do... Isn't it what they do in real life? They do a penifrin, then they do cardiac arrest. They do both. So, how might I be of service, Dr. Reed? All right. I've come to stop the blackmail. This is illegal. Care, I can't carry on with this. I come to stop the blackmail. I've come to put an end to this insufferable blackmailing, Dorothy. Doctor, you think your warnings scare me? I've stolen and plied, blackmailed and lied, but what else am I to do? I'm all these people have. Uh, why target La uh, Lady Ashbury? 
Why not trust Dr. Swensey? The end justify the means. Black Mesa stops now. You've convinced me of the sincerity of your actions and their noble justifications. But all the same, blackmail is a crime, and it will stop Nurse Crane. So, are you going to turn me over to the authorities? Probably. Or kill you if I have the chance. Oh, spare, I look... I look away, but you resign. Okay, so I c it's either I spare. I, I imagine if I would have like talked to her a little bit more, I could have like done that. What she just stole to tell the authorities. But I want to embrace it and end this right now. I'm ending this Nurse right Crane, now. There is no question that the work you've done here is. A I'm gonna embrace her. This Killer is incapable of get more stuff. It's only a question of days before the situation at hand will overwhelm us. I cannot allow it. It's my duty to put an end to this immediately. There we go. Bracer. Ah, there we go. Another kill, boys. I did what was right. For in the end, I saved lives and you took. We had so much in common, Doctor. Don't you see that? What I see is blood everywhere. Mesmerized level. Uh, new citizens able to kill. I've got level two, boys. Here we go. So, all right, it it is like that. All right, so I killed her. Now I'm le mesmerized level two. That's great, boys. That's really good. Really good for us. How about this, please. Locked. Door is door is locked, but I've got a key. Okay. Medical voucher What is that? I don't know boys. Anyways, we've got a bunch of key. So what is that key exactly? We just got shelter key key Rush giving access to Oswald and Newton's shelter key to a shelter. Okay All right boys, so Did what I could I guess A lot of blood, but now we are mesmerized level 2 I think yeah, there we go. So we can kill a lot more people, boys. We're free to kill as many people as we ca as we want now. Well, much, much more uh, people. So four, four, not a lot of people here. I'm going to check who I can actually kill. Who is he? He's missing. Okay. He went missing after his, I killed his son, basically. Uh, four, five. Okay. Three, two, okay, so there's one right here. Darius, I can actually kill him, of course. Uh, Camellia, I don't know anything about her. I'm gonna have to talk to her. So what we're gonna do, boys, hang on. What's going on? There's, uh, there's, there's fucking, uh, there's guys over here. What the hell are they doing here? Did they hear something? No! Kill him. Let's go. Let's just kill him off, I guess. Okay, I don't know why they are here. How How did they get here? Okay, let me just heal myself up, boys. I got a lot of good blood with that, uh, all that stuff. Okay, I can't... There's nothing else for me here. Uh, wait, hang on. There is. Okay, there we go. So... Let's just kill him off. There we go. Oh my god, there's a lot of enemies here. Okay. Let me just take my time, boys. What the fuck is that? Did you see how much damage he did? Okay, that's enough. I've had enough of you, man. You did a lot of damage on me. Holy. Alright. There, uh, where's Dar uh, where's Darius? Oh, he's in there. Okay, he's good. I'm gonna mesmerize. We are gonna go ahead and mesmerize uh, Darius. Hello, Doctor Reed. Come on in. Okay, yeah, we're gonna mesmerize um, Darius. Kill him off. There's a lot of resources here. Just take everything. Okay, let's go ahead and mesmerize you, yeah. buddy. Do I know, like, I know pretty much everything there is to know about him. Yeah, I know everything about him, so we're good. Let's mesmerize him, boys. Time to kill you too. New witnesses. 
All right. I think I can embrace him right here in this house. Yeah, I can. So let's do it, boys. Off to a great start. Two kills. Start uh, two kills already, boys. At the beginning of the video, or in the middle of it, at least. Ah. Who will assist Dorothea helping our comrades now that I die? Here we go. I've got a lot of. I gained a lot of XP by killing these two boys. A lot of XP. Just got a new letter. Okay, there we go. You can. You guys can read that, of course, on your free time. A lot of resources around too. Was a great idea to just come over here, I guess. Hey. So now where do we go now? Where does it want me to go? It wants to me to go back to the hospital, boys. So uh, that's what I'm gonna do, I guess. I'm gonna go back to the hospital and see uh, see what I can do. Give me a minute. We are back at the hospital, boys. Went ahead and uh, spent all my XP points on new stuff. Following night, you bet your ass. The following night, because I've killed two people and it was already pretty serious. Well, now the place is, uh, let me check really quick, hostile, so there's nobody left even. Uh, this guy's gone missing, and everybody basically left or died, yeah, everybody died, basically got killed, so. The, the place is roamed by uh, other creatures of the night and stuff. So really, oh, I can actually kill Tippet now, which that's really a good thing, boys, for us. Let me just go ahead and do that while uh, while we're at it. There we go. Let's just go ahead and kill Tippett, boys. Good evening, Dr. Tippett. Dr. Reed, any good news to share? Okay. Uh, let me just check on his medical, medical stuff. I don't himself. know if I actually have what yes, I need indeed. for him. But don't worry. I am perfectly capable of... I don't know if I actually have the resources. I do? Yeah, I do. I do have uh, some stuff. I'm missing one clue about him. I have no doubt about it, but you are still ill. Just one so clue, boys, so please take I don't know. I Maybe we can get him. I, I don't think at this honest, point I don't care about the clues that diagnosed. much. I really would just wanna kill people. That's all I care about in this game really. Oh, plan of your resignation. I didn't talk about that, so probably that's the last clue. What will you do after your resignation? Do you have a plan? I always fancied visiting Cyprus. Such a beautiful island. I could buy a house there by the sea. Read poetry and wait for death. Okay. Is that it? No, that wasn't it. So... I don't have anything else. So what I'm going to do, I'm just going to mesmerize him. Go ahead and do that. There we go. Just go ahead and mesmerize him. We're gonna make as much kill as, as we can now that we've mesmerized level 2, boys. The kills are gonna come off, boys. We're gonna have a lot of kills now. And this, uh, a couple of people we can actually kill in the uh, in the hospital that we couldn't do that before because it was like they were all higher than level 1. But now that we're actually level 2, we can actually do more, more stuff. So that's really good. We gotta go really far in order to, to kill them, though. God damn, yeah. It's the like seems like the perfect place, but we gotta go really hard. All right, let's get him off, boys. One less doctor today. A third kill for the video, boys. We're doing great, killing so many people. I'm sorry, Nurse Brannigan. I won't witness the great. Doctor, you were destined to be. All right, keys, uh, key of doctor's office. So I've got uh, the keys to his office and stuff. That's really good. All right. Um, so she's level three. Let me just see really quick everywhere. Just want to see everywhere. Level three as well. Level six. Okay. I think I'm good. Level 4. So, who's level 2 in there? There's gotta be... There's more level 2s that I know of. But what? What's going on here? Level 2? Level 4. Okay, sh he's a level 2. 
He's healthy, but he doesn't have that much XP. That's that's okay. I don't care Good that evening, much. Mr. Goswick. How are you? I'm okay. Um that's because I don't know anything about him. Okay. Uh I think it's time to kill you off, buddy. While our mother is basically watching, basically like she doesn't like she, she doesn't think this is weird the fact that I just did that to her son or something. Like uh, this isn't uh, suspicious at all, right? <laughs> Whatever, boys. It's not suspicious at all to her. I just did it in front of her. All right, we're gonna have another kill, boys. Not uh, another kill. I think we're gonna. We might have like three, four to six kill, or five to six kills in this video. There's another one right here. Th this place is gonna become hostile. The next day I'm gonna. I'm gonna, the next time I'm gonna go on the bed, I'm gonna rake up for another day, boys. The other day is gonna be hostile because look how many people I just killed already. Already two people killed here. Mother, were you right all along? Okay, Mortimer Gowick's key. I'm so sorry. Okay. I'm so sorry. Okay, so we already we got a lot of XP from that. I'm looking for... I know who is level 2 as well in this place. I know for a fact... I haven't... There's someone I haven't talked to in here. Can't uh, seem to get to here and uh, get to him or something. He's a level 2. Milton Helms is actually a level 2, boys. Okay, so she's in there. Uh, before I talk to her, there's... Milton Hills, which is a level 2. I, I can actually look right here, boys, who's level 2 and stuff. So, 4-4. Four, four. Uh, Telma, I gotta find her. That's the thing, I gotta find her. I don't know where she is. Uh, lost. Oh, we lost her. We actually lost her. There we go. Okay, that's the, that's the reason. Because I couldn't find her in the hospital. She actually got lost. Okay. Uh, he's more than likely... Okay, he's missing. So four, five, two. So it's the only guy. It's the only guy I can actually kill right now. So let's just go ahead and kill him. Do a third kill in this place. Good evening, Milton. Good evening, Doctor. Everybody's gonna. To there's not gonna be anybody left for me here, boys. Uh, I've got everything I need. Let's just do, do a medical, medical checkup to Milton. see, I'm make sure that he's fully I'm healed up. I get as much XP as possible from him. Of affairs when even the hospital workers are worried about disease. Yeah. Our job brings us into just gonna make sure boys that everybody is fully healed up when There's I kill no them in being ill while you I want husband. as much XP yeah, as possible say, doctor. I'll get the feeling you don't fall sick often but thanks anyway okay there we go now he's recovered there we go 2000 XP that's pretty good boys let's go ahead and mesmerize him get another kill okay. uh, I know who's gonna be missing I think one of the nurses, the nurse that was actually with him, I think it's Hawkins. She's definitely going to be missing after all of this. Definitely, boys. Uh, she's not going to be even there. Like, she's going to flee for her life. But we're going to lose a lot of people pretty quick. I don't care that much if it injures the story. I just want to kill people, boys. I'm a vampire. I just want to do... I, I want to do everything. I want to kill people. It's going to be really interesting for me. Alright, let's go, boys. Kill another guy. There we go. That's my sixth uh, kill, I think. I think that's my my fifth one or my sixth. I don't know. You guys noticed all of them, people, so... People, my princess. Flee away while you can. For all is lost. I've got a shotgun, but not that interesting because I already have a better gun than that. Okay. Unless... Wait, hang on a minute. Unless his gun is... Mine is doing 87. Oh my god, no, that does a lot of damage. Never mind. If that one does a lot of damage. I'm going to keep his uh, shotgun, boys. Holy. Yeah, let's keep his shotgun then. Yeah, that's really good. Okay. So, we don't have anything else. I've got a lot of XP. 
We're gonna go ahead and talk to Lady Ash uh, Ashbury because it's our main mission. So let's go ahead and do that, boys. <gasps> oh shit! She did kill him. Oh don't. No, it's all right, lady. I mean, you haven't noticed I just killed three people in this hospital too, so it's all fine, really. I would ask you to avert your eyes, sir, or did you not know it was rude to stare? I knew it. Speak up, Doctor Reed. I like a man who speaks his mind. He trusted you. It in in the end, you're a killer. Compassion only hides your appetite. Hiding your true appetites behind a facade of compassion. Bravo. Very clever indeed. Spare me your sarcasm, Jonathan. You are but newly born in this world. We are vampires after all. So the accusation was true. No need to apologize. We are vampires after all. We are vampires. We live by leeching the blood from weaker prey. We are Darwin's next chapter. His cynical and perhaps ultimate expression. The situation is somewhat awkward, nonetheless. I have not been observed sustaining myself for many decades. I have to say, I'm a trifle embarrassed. Anyway, I have concluded my inquiries concerning your blackmail. He's dead and done for. I see. Please excuse my agitated state. Under normal circumstances, I wouldn't let anyone see me in this condition. The case is closed. Permanently. You will not be bothered anymore by the woman. And who was this woman? If you must know, she worked under my employ as Nurse Crane. But I'll wager that's not what will be written on her gravestone. You killed her? Is that what you consider discretion and diplomacy, Doctor? I'm a vampire. I, I kill people. Best and acted accordingly. You will learn that trust is a rare and precious commodity in the Immortals' world, my young Doctor. And your actions have not induced me to offer you my support. Do I really need your support though? About London, all right, so now she's gonna answer my stuff. About ladyship, about London. Uh, no, what about me now? Voice in my ear. Am I a vampire? Why, why was I left for dead? I don't understand. Why was I created and then left for dead? That is a question only the one who made you can answer. It's not normal practice. I doubt even if you find him, he will answer you, considering how cruelly he treated you. Could it be a mistake? How are vampires created? I'd like to avoid creating another vampire by mistake. No, I would like that. I would like to create more vampires. How is it done? Capable ones. <sighs> the process is dangerous. It could even kill your potential progeny. If you did decide to sire an offspring, Oh, ah, all right. It's just like Buffy and stuff. All right, so it it's basically the same way as Buffy and Angel. So me being a vampire could have been a mistake. I very much doubt it, Jonathan. Contrary to the legends, it is not as simple to make another vampire by just biting someone. Okay. Uh, am I a vampire? No, I know I'm a vampire. Voice in my head. What about the voice? I've been hearing a voice talking in my head. Is this some kind of insanity? It feels like the voice of the vampire that created me. Hush. Tell no one this. It would be unwise to talk of such things amongst British immortals. Speak no more of your maker. How could this cause offense? Are you a maker? Are you my maker? Excuse my forwardness, but. Are you my maker? Me? Goodness, no. Only a foolish immortal would create a progeny without taking precaution. And I'm no fool. How could this cause offense? Only the powerful immortals can mentally call to their progeny. No vampire or hunter will sleep easy knowing that an unidentified elder is stalking the streets of London. All right, so... That's why you want to That's why you want to be cautious when you create another vampire is because you want to make sure that you are powerful enough to get him under your command. All right. 
about London. What happened to London? How many vampires are in London? I'm, I met some vampires uh, hunters. I think I'm good, boys. Honestly, I know everything. Swinzes allows you to kill. How old are you? Oh, I, I want to. Yeah, I want to know about that. I know this is beyond the pale, but may I inquire your age? Really? And I thought you were gentlemen. If you must know, I'm 27. I've been 27 for a long time now, and 27 I shall remain. Really? Why don't you tell me your real age? I don't care about 27. This is uh, not all the truth. Who granted your eternal roof, youth? And who bestowed upon you this eternal youth? My maker. He left this isle a long time ago. So she killed him or something? Very well. But I believe there is more to this than you are saying. A lady has to have some secrets. If you say so. Why did you save me in the canning factory? I could hardly stand by and watch such a promising young blood as yourself be torn to shreds by some gutter scowl. William did not create me? Uh, what is a skull? What type of vampire is a skull? Not a true vampire. The deformed offspring of lesser vampires. It is a shame these creatures run wild, slaves to their baser instincts. William Bishop wasn't the vampire that created me then. No, Jonathan. Whatever their strength and demeanor, skulls are the progeny of careless vampires. It cannot be the other way round. Why does Dr. Swansea allow you to feed on the patients of the hospital? Dr. Swansea is a good and compassionate man. He is trying to find a solution for our... hunger. Until that happens, he is clever enough to understand that I only feed upon the dying. Well, if that's not the case for me, then, though, no one suspected you? And no one suspected you of the murders. As you well know, suspicion has recently fallen on me of killing for pleasure. Oh, all right. But you have my word, Jonathan. I take no pleasure in taking a life. I do, though. I do. What do you know? I'm a real the vampire. Of St. Paul's stole. The Brotherhood is well known amongst London vampire society. As long as our kind is discreet. And as long as they do not interfere, we have come to a mutual understanding. All right, I think I know everything I need to know, boys. I bid you farewell, for now, my lady. Yeah, I don't have anything I else about her. Analyze the blood I took from Nurse Crane's patient. Oh yeah, I gotta analyze the blood. So I gotta go back, basically. Um, how is she? She's level 20. It, there's no way I'm never going to be able to, like, mesmerize her or kill her. Maybe I'm going to have a battle, a boss battle with her at the very end or something like that, boys. I'm just going to go back to my bed. And, uh, I'll see you for next video, boys. Hopefully next video. I don't know what's going to happen. Is this place going to become hostile or something? Because after all, I did kill three, I, ju I did just kill three people. And there's gotta be like nobody left basically almost in this place. So I don't know. I hope you guys enjoyed the video. I'm gonna see you guys for the next one. Remember to leave a like and subscribe to the end of the video. Keep it easy boys.